Look. Come on. Raina. Come here. Raina. Over here. Come back, Kale. What are you doing? Hey, give Raina and uh, Thor a hug. I'm taking a video of you. Hey, come over here. Ray, what's he doing? Take a picture with the puppies. Oh, you're taking your own. <laughs> okay. Hi, beautiful boy. Hey, pretty girl. Ray, look at, what are you just watching what picture? quite a few questions about um, the process of breeding and how Thor and Reyna are interacting. Right now they have been moved to a, a place where they are only with each other. Unlike the rest of our pack who commingles on a daily basis, um, these two are just all about each other right now. Um, something that we typically see right now is weight loss in the male. Unfortunately, all he's thinking about is one thing. Um, so the video will be G-rated, but um, we're not quite there to the moment of breeding, but we are anticipatory in about 10 days or less and counting with actual breeding taking place. So we just wanted to review with our families um, that are already existing for this particular litter and are anticipating their new babies and also maybe potential families. Um, what the two are interacting like, how they look like, what we are seeing, and um, we hope that you find it informative. And we'll just start with that. Right, Thor. So, one of the first things that you can see, right, one of the first things that you can see, you're going to want to come around the back. I want to show them some racket. Right, Thor. Come on, Thor. say, what are you doing to me? Okay, you can see here, she's swollen at the vulva. She has began um, some bleeding. Thor is always at interest. Um, so the way that he checks her is literally by sniffing her urine and by um, smelling her. Once he knows that she's in her, her sweet spot, that's when um, he basically makes his, his move. Until that point, she's unreceptive of him and it's just important to let the process happen naturally and organically. At the point that they actually have their breeding, um, we'll be back in, you know, waiting a day. They'll actually spend a day apart and then they'll come back together. Really be sure we Sure, come here. That is making fun and so, you know, Thor, Thor looks pretty good for being this close to being the breeding age. You can tell he's a little bit, uh, he's lost about seven pounds. So we just try to supplement his food as much as possible. But like I said, um, he's, he's on a raw diet and he's getting extra, but he really isn't interested in food so much as he's interested in whatever she's doing, um, how she's smelling, how she's acting. So um, they're hundred percent living with each other at this point in time. And, uh, I don't. I don't really know if there's anything else outside of questions that the families have. 
but I think you can post it in this video and I'll definitely respond to them. Um, I will make this video public so um, you guys can keep up on the thread with the families that are involved or if you feel more comfortable you can personal email me and ask me some questions either about Florida or Raina or how everything is progressing. Thank you.